Morning. Good morning, everyone. Just going to wait here a few minutes. Get a couple more people in here. Who's here today? Hi, Tina A. Good morning. What's up for you today? Good morning, Debbie. Well, this morning, I'm going to be working on a little steampunk birdhouse. And it's just adorable, I think, so far. And it's this little guy. Isn't that pretty? Hi, Dorinda. Good morning. And um, so this took me about two days to put on. And I just didn't want to do it all on a live. So I'll be coloring this uh, this morning. And that's the front. And then I put a chain on it. This is hopefully going to be able to go outside. And I've got some little rings I was able to put on over this chain. This is really a nice chain. I love this chain. So, I guess we'll get started. And I'm going to wear gloves because I don't want some of this stuff to get on me. It's hard to get off. I don't like to go shopping with paint on my hands. <laughs> Thank you, Tina. Thank you, Dorinda. We all got planned for this weekend. Anything good? I'm so glad I'm not in that path of that storm. So I'll try and stay in, in frame today. Let's see. I think I'm going to start out with a little bit of rust color. This is a watch. I'm going to paint over everything. I think that's the way this person likes it. This is going to be for a, a subscriber. And he said he likes steampunk. So that's what I'm going to give him. And see what happens. Oh, I hate to do this. <laughs> okay, let's start over here. Yep, it's been a long week, I think, for everybody. I'll make this look a little rusty. So are, are any of you in the, the path of that storm? I hope not. Well, this piece right here is a great big long feather. It's a beautiful piece. Good morning, Monica. Glad you're with us this morning. Yep, you're going to get a lot of rain, Debbie. I, I think so, too. Stir up those uh, alligators down there. Good 
Oh, this shouldn't take me too long to do. I don't know about some of these pieces. Uh, they might not stick. Oh, no. Panther in the yard. That's not good. Let's see. We got cougars up here, I think. Once in a while, we get a bear. Come down from the north. Abby, you're getting some amazing stuff for your, um, oh, thank you, for your gypsy book. It's going to be nice. It makes me want to get going on mine, but I just don't have time right now. Okay, so that's the first color. It's just a, a little wooden birdhouse that I um, received from someone. And it was all painted really nice with kind of like toll painting. Well, you got plenty to do. Uh, two or three books, I think. Good morning, Don. Hello. Just getting started on my steampunk birdhouse. Okay, I think I'll put some blue on. A little bit of blue. Yeah, I think you're going to get hooked on uh, gypsy stuff. <laughs> it's fun. Get to use all those colors and textures, and you don't have to be little. You get real big with it. I think the bigger, the bigger you go with it, the better it looks. Yep. I think my first um, doily book was a gypsy book. It's always fun to try something new.
That is a pretty blue spray Reese glossy dimension. See, Michaels is having a sale. Might have to go over there this morning. Good morning, Christina. Glad you came by this morning. Just working on a little steampunk today. Take a break from the Christmas ornaments. But I will be doing Christmas ornaments next Friday. Something fun and really, really easy. Yeah, well, they got hot buys on paper. Uh, some things are 70% off. Hope my store has got some new paper in. They've, they're low on paper pads. Good morning, Joyce. Well, where you been? We've been missing you, too. Only one good paper pad. Yeah, I think they're late in getting their papers out. Hi, Joey. Good morning. Well, I seen an ad this morning and it said uh, hot hot buy paper pads were on sale for five dollars. Slept late. I think I've slept late for a long time, unless I was sick. Hey, good, <laughs> good morning, New York. That's Tanya. Good morning, Farmall. How's it going? I watched you eat apples the other day. So I had to go out and get me some caramel for my apples. Oh, well, congratulations, Debbie. Congratulations. Okay, I think I'm done with the blue. So, do we want to put a little bit of pink on it? This is really, really bright, so I'm not going to use too much. Just a little touch.
Oh, did you like it? <laughs> I'm glad. I'm really glad. It was a cute little doll head. Yep. You can leave that up all year, too. Let's see. Where do I want just a touch? Good morning, ma'am. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. Just playing around with a little bit of paint this morning. Doing a little birdhouse here. Let's see. Uh, yeah, Mim, uh, he's in, are you in the Netherlands, I think? But anyway, I watched you eat tacos for the first time last night. Ah, they were good, weren't they? <laughs> no, Joyce, no, this has taken me too two days just to get all the stuff on it and it that would just be too long for a video so no i um i got it to this point and then i thought i would paint it online so that's going to take most of my time because i'm kind of fussy i'm probably not doing it right anyway but closer to denmark okay <laughs> uh, you know, Farmer was eating apples and Mim was eating tacos. <laughs> yeah, I watch those kind of videos. I don't know. I I guess I do art my way. That's good enough. Yeah, Denmark. Let me see. My ancestors came from Denmark. Um, I'm a great Dane. Amongst other things. <laughs> Irish. Thank you. <clears throat> I didn't have <clears throat> many gears to put on it. I've, I've got some ordered, but I got a few on here. Have I missed anybody to say good morning to? If I have, let me know. I think I've got enough pink on there. Did I do this side? And just a touch. Okay. Oops, I'm out of out of frame here, guys. Good morning, Therese. How are you? We're going to put some gold now. I'll use this Inca gold. Thank you, Debbie, for being my moderator today.
I'm pretty good. Going to go shopping today. My shopping time is getting limited. It's starting to get a little chilly out. Well, thank you, Deb. So, got to get as much shopping in as I can. I'd have to rub this on. Yeah. I shop quite a bit. I, sometimes I don't buy anything. I just go. It's cold in England. Let's see. Everybody hook up. If you see somebody new, subscribe to them. So what's everybody working on? Anything good? Yeah, working on an album. I know Debbie's getting ready to do her gypsy book. I can't wait. It's going to be awesome. Oh, you got to go to work. I'm sorry. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, ma'am. Come back. Mm, it's getting kind of late, isn't it, Debbie, to be painting? Oh, gosh. Um, 
Tanya, everybody's a, uh, an RN. Um, are you in the emergency room? Is that where you work, or is it just a general all over? She's got a hard job, everybody. I don't know, Tanya. They might be calling you to go go work with that hurricane. Oh, you start you start early, yep. I don't know how amazing it is. It's prettier in person. It it looks a little muted on the screen, but it's really pretty in person. Get down here, get some gold going there. But thank you. Hi, Paula. Good morning. You're in the ER? Yeah. That's a tough spot to be in. I don't think I'm happy with this gold. I'm going to switch. You want to see it up close? I put the letter J here. So that's one side. That's the front. The other side. And the back. Yeah, it's got a beautiful, unusual chain on it. And I put um, some keys on it. So I'll spray it all with clear varnish and you'll be able to put it outside. <laughs> oh, whose name starts with a J? Good morning, fam. Hello, thank you for coming in. Good morning, China. There's two new people there, everybody. Please sub to them and make them feel welcome. Better get back in screen here. Just put a little bit more gold. Well, thank you, um, Tanya. See, I think I got gold over here. A little bit on the roof. <laughs> Dorinda. <laughs> uh huh. Well, you might know who it is. It's for Jason? Question mark. He's not here today, though. I don't think. Yep. 
I don't get to send too many guys um, happy mail, friend mail, so I thought I'd send him this. No, I think that, I guess it looks all right. Does that, does that look sloppy? I might have to add some purple. Maybe that's what I'm missing. I don't see Angela. Who is that? Is that Femme? Oh, there's Chronic Crafter. That's... Okay, yep, that's Angela. I had to look. Okay, I think I'm done messing with this gold. A lot of people do um, really, really dark steampunk, and I'm not into that. I like to see my colors. I'm going to put a little bit of gold up here. Um, these are just scraps of jewelry. Um, you can buy all kinds of little things. This is an old watch that Kathy Randall gave me. And then I took the guts out. And this right here is the guts to the watch. So you can pick up a, a lot of this is just junk jewelry. Old chains, little pieces of plastic. And now I'm going to add just a touch of purple. Let's see, purple. I've lost my purple. Oh, here it is. Okay, I will do that, China. <laughs> I'll make you one. Oh, yeah, I buy a lot of uh, junk jewelry. Um, I've gotten some from Brandy. She's got some nice junk jewelry. So does Kathy. Just need just a little touch of purple, I think. I think I'd rather put this on by hand. Oh, yeah. That looks better. Lucky Jason. Jason's a gamer I watch all the time. I don't understand it, but I do like to watch. Yeah, lots of purple. <laughs> yeah, let's see. I'm kind of looking at it the way you guys are seeing it. A little bit of touch right there. This purple is this, the metallic. I got this at Michael's. Got all different colors, beautiful colors there. Everybody's sub to one another. 
You probably all have each other by now. Yeah, this looks a little muddy, but it really isn't. It's really pretty. My camera's not doing it justice. Thank you. Yes, please. So I hope you all seen my video yesterday. I'm still mad. <laughs> Try to scam me. Ah. But I feel bad for a lot of the old people that do actually believe that stuff. So I think we all need to start posting our scams, especially the ones that you can prove with an email. Let's see. This looks a little sloppy here. It's a, I don't know, I just don't like scammers and I don't like bullies. So the, the bullies are probably going to get the same treatment. So far I haven't been bullied. <laughs> uh, it's coming though, I'm sure. Yep, just for you, because <laughs> you're so special. Put it on Facebook, too. <laughs> hey, Debbie, thanks for coming back. Thank you. Thank you, Tanya. Uh, everybody, thank you for coming in today. So if this was mine, I would have left it. I wouldn't have painted over it. But I try to do what they like. Okay, I don't know if I'm, oh, I don't think I got any purple over here. Yep, yep, I get a little smart mouth sometimes. I've always had a smart mouth when it comes to stuff like that. I don't hold back either. <laughs> nah, I don't trust anybody anymore either. Although I've, I've never been scammed, I just don't like them um, doing it to, you know, innocent people. Like, I've known people who have gotten scammed. 
my dad was always falling for that stuff. I really had to watch him. Bless his heart. So watch, watch your elders. I always see somebody on TV, an elder person, getting getting their life savings wiped out. Let's see. <laughs> oh, I should have just done all purple. Uh huh. I was thinking about doing an all gold one. I think that'd be awesome. But. I don't want y'all laughing at me. <laughs> I'll put some purple down in here. So do you think I should put some glitter on this? I've got some extreme glitter. Yep, they are. Very trusting. Well, back in the day, we were able to trust a lot of people. Okay, you're going to cook some breakfast. I'm hungry, too. Cook me something. Purple and gold. That's Viking colors, you know, Joyce. Yep, scammers. Just they'd like to do them bodily harm. Yeah, I'm thinking about putting a little bit of glitter on there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, put a lot of glitter on it, huh? Let's see what happens. Okay, so I'll let you guys take a look and, and tell me if I needed any more color. Boy, that's got a lot of purple on it. I might have to go back and... Does that side got purple? I miss that side, I think. Just a little bit of purple on this side. Okay, that's enough purple. Okay, so there's that side. I think I might want to go back and put some gold right here. It has a big block of purple. Yep, I kind of have to put a little bit more gold. Yeah. Break up that purple just a bit. I'm checking because I can't. I can't really see here. I'm kind of sitting in the dark. I got too much purple here. Okay. 
I think I can see better on camera than I can sitting here. It doesn't need any more color. I'm kind of toning down a little bit of the brighter colors. Just a little bit of gold over it. It breaks it up. I think that's good. I really like this one. A streak of blue here. Okay. So, let's put some glitter, a little bit of glitter. I'm just going to put a little bit of glitter on, on the metal, not on the wood. This glitter will kind of seal it also because all it is is white glue. But I'm going to spray it anyway. It's about time to throw this brush away. I'm losing some bristles. So the glitter will make it really shiny in the in the daylight outside. Oh, white gesso. Mm. Well, I don't have any, for one thing. Um, I think it's fine. It's, it's prettier in person. <laughs> Now, I've seen a lot of steampunk that is shabby chic steampunk, and they're, they're all about those colors, and they do put gesso on those, which they are really pretty, too. It'll start standing out here in a couple minutes, I think. If not, I can put some silver on it, too. I don't have any silver on it right yet. So I'm going to let that sit and dry. I think I got all sides. Probably can dry this with uh, that out of the way. 
Uh, IOB, I don't know. Ask uh, Tanya, New York style. IOB. So let's um, maybe put a touch of silver on. What do you think? Silver, okay. I'll just put a little bit on. It's this color, though. I think that's the only silver I have. I've got this, though. I haven't used it yet. What do you think? Which one? The paste or the mixative? Well, we can always do both and see what happens. I just put a little, tiny little bit on. Like on the scissors and a little bit on the wings. Let's start on the scissors. That's kind of pretty. Just on the tips of the wings. Yep, very little. No, not on everything. See, that gives the wings a little bit of definition. Get up here, if I get up there. Get my other little brush. Just using a tiny little brush to get the wing, the tip of the wings. Now, does that look better? Can you tell? It's really hard. I put a little bit on the scissors. And a little bit on those wings. Let's see who else needs little, little silver. Maybe a little bit on this butterfly here. This is some nice silver, guys. I really like it. Little dub way down here. Okay. 
Maybe the man in the moon a little bit of silver. Touch. Good morning, Judy. I think that's it. It's another part of a key here. It's not too heavy. Uh, maybe a pound, if that much. I think I'm going to call this one done. I think I'm done. Okay. So this is the mixative. This is really nice. I got this in silver and in gold. And I really like this. So now all I have to do is give it a clear coat and it's done. So I'll let me clean this up just a bit. Now remove my paper and take off my gloves. Everything held, all the glue held, but I think I'm still looking for a better glue um, other than E6000. I might have to get some Gorilla, uh, gorilla Glue. Move this out of the way here. Save my paper for the next time. Um, so let me see if I can lay this down so you can see it better. That's okay, Judy. You can always go watch the replay. Would love to have you do that. So this is my birdhouse. Just have to clear coat it. And this is with this beautiful chain. I love this chain. I almost didn't give it up. <laughs> and then I've got um, some rings on each side. So that's kind of cool with the rings up there. He can actually take this off and and uh, use the rings elsewhere if he wanted to. And that's it. This was fun to do. It was a break from my ornaments. Lots of goodies in there. So I've got uh, an, an ornament I can show you if you all want to see it. I'll close this here. I'll be right back. I got a couple little ones done. Put that aside. Hello, Deborah. Thank you for coming in this morning. 
So here's uh, a little one that I did with just some um, really light fabric. Uh, these are appliques that was put on um, kind of like a netting. So I cut them out, fussy cut them out. And then I burnt the edges so you don't see any of the netting. <coughs> Hi, Rosa. Good morning. And I even covered the top with the little net, uh, little appliques up on the top. And then, of course, I had hung some uh, fringe trim. And I even did the bottom. And this has uh, Easter grass in it. So it'll really sparkle. <coughs> and a little hanger. <coughs> Sorry. And then this one. <coughs> this uh, traditional red and gold. Did the same thing, cut out some appliques, gold appliques, put some bows on it, a little bit of red and white dangles. And I also did the bottom on this one too. Because if you're hanging this on a tree way up high, you're going to see the bottom. So you want the bottom done also. So these both are glass ornaments. They're not the plastic. And did I put anything inside? No, this one's covered with a red fabric, uh, like a red netting. And these are so easy to do. So, I think I'm almost getting done. I think I got four more ovals to do. And I'm going to call Christmas done. Well, thank you. Chili Arts, I haven't seen you here before. Are you new? Thank you for coming over today. Thank you very much. And I just, I'm done with the steampunk. I just got to let it dry a little bit, go spray it, and put it in the mail. This one's going to Jason. Yeah, I like the ovals too. Chili, not chili. Chili. Oh, chi. I'm sorry. Is it chi? Okay. Am I saying it right now? Chi? So I'm going to I'm going to sign off today and get busy. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I look like chili. <laughs> I don't have my glasses on. And um, the next time I'll be live is Wednesday at my channel. I'm going to do something really nice, really, really pretty. And uh, I'll be there at 1230 Eastern Standard Time. And then next Friday, I'm going to be working on some different type of Christmas ornaments. Nothing that involves glass or plastic this time. Very easy for you all to do. So thank you all for coming today. You, you all have a wonderful weekend. Everybody uh, stay safe and stay dry. And I hope nobody gets flooded out. I know that's an impossible hope, but... Gosh, I wish that storm would turn. Um, we really didn't need to get hit again. Yes, thank you, everybody, for coming in. Um, I sure appreciate your support and your love. So we'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>